Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube. So today we are having a mini gender reveal with our family and we planned it super last minute. are going to just reveal with our parents and our siblings and then everybody else is going to join us on Zoom. So today I wanted to bring you guys along with me. So yeah, we're going to go pick up some buntinis and balloon that has confetti in it and then we're gonna head to my mom's sit up a little bit and yeah we're gonna get together so see you guys soon real quick i had to pick something from my closet that hopefully fit me um it was hard <laughs> Um, because what I really wanted to wear did not fit anymore. But anyways, wanted to show you guys my outfit. So I, my hair is whatever's. I have this dress. It's like a lacy dress in my closet. As you can tell. Kind of looks better in person. but. And I threw on these tennis shoes because I did not feel like running the errands that we need to run in heels. But here is the belly. We are officially 19 weeks, so the be the belly is definitely growing. To me, maybe a boy, but to others, maybe a girl. So I'm really nervous to find out, but I'm glad we're finally going to find out. So I just wanted to show you guys the outfit and the little bump okay so real quick i just wanted to let you guys know something so adam and i did not tell anybody to help us plan this gender reveal so no one in our family actually knows before us uh we went to party city and we asked an associate there if they can help us kind of get the things that we needed if we showed them the envelope that said you know what we were having but how cute is my doctor's top secret so cute so they opened it and then she ended up getting everything for us as we left the store and then came back but they also ran out of the balloons so they just filled an uh black latex balloon for us and they wrote girl or boy like the girl there was so nice she was so helpful and they just made it super easy um for us and she was like oh congratulations and i don't know i'm just so happy that uh we were able to get a really nice associate to help us out and just help us plan this and put it together so that you know all of us could celebrate and be surprised at once and no one we know knows that was like the main thing because i already know like myself and i know that I would like try to read the person that knows so I just was like no I don't want anybody that I know to know so that I can't bug anybody at all and I'm just as surprised so Adam's just in the uh, nothing but bunk cakes store picking up our buntinis and then we're gonna head to my mom's it is currently 3 30 it's been a crazy day so see you guys at my mom well hello y'all end up just putting some drinks these little tins and we got some pantinis flowers very simple chips and then here is my balloon garland i wanted and that's my bella bear she's my little doggy huh my baby yeah she is my princess that is the man of the hour he made all this happen <laughs> And my mom. <laughs> We're just waiting for our guest so we can eat and then set up our Zoom. Are you recording on yours? I'm, I'm so glad. Wait, are we popping at the same time? Yeah. 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 Are you going to go to the front? Well, yeah. 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 You're ready? Yeah. You're ready? Yeah. 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 All right. Five, four, oh, oh, three, <laughs> two, one. Five. Oh, 
messed with my head. Is it wrong? Good morning, you guys. Got my coffee. I am so tired today. Excuse my hair and my face. I did not put it on my lashes yet. I don't really want to put them on. I'm trying to wake up. Well, let me sit down because I'm out of breath. Whew. It's been exactly a week since my gender reveal. Yeah, I, <laughs> I'm laughing because I was so nervous. Uh, oh my God, I just... I could not believe I was about to find out. I could not believe it was a girl. Adam had said from the very beginning, he's like, it's gonna be a girl, like I already know. So it wasn't really new news in a sense to him or surprising news, but to me, I just was like, no, I want a girl and I know I'm gonna get a boy. And I really felt like I was gonna get a boy. Even if I had a boy, I know that I was gonna be happy and excited. It was so much fun. The adrenaline that day was, I don't know, it was unbelievable. We ended up just inviting our immediate family. We included the rest of our family who wanted to join on Zoom. Last minute, my aunt kind of gave us a little bit more insight on Zoom and how it worked. So that morning, we sent out a text with the meeting and password. It was actually really cool being able to experience this through Zoom on our end. I don't know how it was for people from home, the only thing is like, I wish, you know, we could have spent time with the people on Zoom. Yeah, I just want to thank my family for really like just logging in and watching and being a part of it. Because now we actually have video of all of that. It's like great to have for my daughter to see it when she grows up and really just sees like what our life was like at this moment in time. I want to show you guys some of the outfits that we've already received for the baby. I woke up with so much energy this morning and then I got ready and as you can tell I'm out of breath for nothing and uh just happens. Before I go into the whole little baby haul that I have I just wanted to give you guys an update on how I've been feeling as far as the pregnancy goes. As you guys know, my first trimester was really tough on me physically and mentally. I was sick all the time. There was always something wrong. I was tired, had no energy, and just as crazy as it sounds, like I just felt miserable. Not about the pregnancy, but just how I felt. I wasn't myself, and anybody who knows what it's like to not feel like yourself knows that it's not... A good feeling it doesn't feel good to feel like depressed we all want to be happy and we want to enjoy the moments I'm just glad that all those symptoms and all those feelings you know kind of just already went away for me but I feel amazing I have so much energy I have a will to do things and be productive obviously not every day some days I'm just I am tired I am five months pregnant I've already started my baby registry. I expect to have that completed in the next week. And then following that, I'm starting to plan uh, my baby shower. And I want to do that way in advance as well because I don't want to wait till the last minute to do things when I'm tired. I don't know what I'm going to feel. But if it's anything like the first trimester, I am definitely uh, preparing myself for the worst. Let's start off with the swaddles i got two swaddles thank you to my mom and michelle for buying us these items um also there's something here from my sister-in-law too so the baby has been getting spoiled we got two swaddles and omg here they are but i love the florals and i love the colors it's this outfit this like onesie so I'm really liking all these like onesies, especially like this has a zipper, so it'd be like easier um, when she's young to like change her. I also got this little set. It comes with three headbands and then three mittens. We got some bibs. So we got these little ones here that are 
really nice and um, perfect for when she like probably gets a little older if they fit around her neck when she's a newborn that'd be great because they're very thin and lightweight so I like that a lot and then these super duper cute bandana bibs which are so adorable I love all the floral themes my mom got her her first little doll we got a blanket I love how like soft they are on the inside and like I don't know I just want to cuddle up in this one myself oh this is so freaking cute and I love that it's like blue because we're kind of like gonna probably have a bunch of pink also got this cute little two-piece outfit or actually it's a three-piece because it comes with the bib the shirt and then the little butt she's gonna be a February baby so all the love and hearts that we can get and sister-in-law she got us so a three-piece bodysuit outfit she's gonna be styling this onesie which i love it also has the buttons down here so her closet is starting to grow thank you guys for tuning in to this video and sharing this amazing experience with us as soon as i get more baby things i do want to share like what's going to be in my hospital bag, my diaper bag, but those are hard things that I don't know what I want. I don't know what to look for in a diaper bag. So if anybody knows or has any suggestions for diaper bags, if you can link them below, that would be so helpful to me because I'm a first time mom. I don't know what I need to have in a diaper bag. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.